This is February the 4th, 2019. Article on CNN Politics. This is written by Mallory Simon, Sarah Seidner, and Ralph Ellis of CNN. Title, Other Racist Photos Found in Northam's Medical School Yearbook. Hmm. Here's an embedded video. You'll see him with his charming wife. During a free willing press conference to address a racist photo on his medical school yearbook page, Virginia Governor Ralph Northam said he wouldn't be surprised if other photos like that were found in the 1984 Eastern Virginia Medical School yearbook. Why would he say that unless he knew? On Sunday, CNN found more racist and objectable images in her book. None of them appear to show Northam. Democrats from across the nation demanded Northam resign after yearbook photos surfaced showing one person wearing blackface and another dressed in the Ku Klux Klan signature white hood and robes. The photo appears on Northam's personal yearbook page, among other photos of him from school. After first apologizing for appearing in the race's photos, Northam now says he wasn't in it and won't resign. In the same yearbook, CNN found the following images. On page 10 of the yearbook, a photo shows a man dressed up like a woman in a low-cut white dress, pearls, a black wig, and black face. Next to the photo is the caption, Baby Love. Whoever thought Diana Ross would make it to medical school? an apparent reference to the lead singer of the Supremes, a Motown singing group made up of three black women. A woman behind him is wearing a hat as if she is dressed like a witch. The photo is on page full of photos of other students, outings and parties. Later in the yearbook, in a section devoted to student personal pages, a photo of three men with their faces blackened, wearing white dresses, white gloves, pearls, and wigs appears. That photo appears on the page before Northam's personal page. It is surrounded by other photos of the students at school and has no captions. On page 34, the pharmacology page, a photo of a white man, not in a black face, shows him holding a coffee mug wearing the words, we can't get fired. Slaves have to be sold. On page 10 there's also a photo of a man groping a mannequin with the words, I try never to divulge my true feelings while examining my patients. CNN is not publishing images pending comment or confirmation from the individuals pictured. Alright, so folks, uh, are you sort of getting the picture? You know what I find really interesting as well? Hillary Clinton said, enough's enough, it's time to resign. What about her support, her eulogy she gave to Senator Byrd? Huh? A grand cyclops in the KKK. I wonder if Hillary ever wore one of those outfits. I wouldn't be surprised, would you? There's more to read. You want to take a look at this link and uh, sort of decide for yourself. Personally, I think he's toast. I don't see how he can survive this. Do you? <laughs> Thanks for listening. You might want to repost this in all your social media accounts. You might want to send it to your like-minded friends and ask them to do the same. You might want to send a copy to Ralph Northam. Thanks for listening.